All right, I'm going to be tasting the, uh, the Blood Ghost today. Um, don't know too much about it. I heard it's pretty delicious, but other than that, I have no idea. Just going to toss it in down the hatch. <clears throat> Excuse me. Pretty uh hot right off the bat. Um Definitely uh super duper hot one. Um, probably not as hot as the pepper I ate last night. Um, but still very, uh, very painful in the throat. I'm sweating. Um, lots of, uh, salivating. It's very, uh interesting flavor there's like a, a subtle hint of something uh fruity but i can't put my finger on it um the heat right now is mainly focused in the throat um and uh a little bit on the top of the tongue <coughs> Note to self, don't inhale saliva. It doesn't seem to be getting hotter at the moment, um, but it does have that... Uh, resurgence of pain every time I speak, breathe out, or swallow, spit. Um, yeah, and the, the heat is a very, like, sharp, stinging sensation in the back of the throat, mainly. Seems to be fairly steady. Um, that sharp sting in the back of the throat, man, that, that gets me. Like I said, though, it's not quite as bad as uh, the... Uh, Marupi Amarillo, white, red Fino. That was abysmal. But this is also no joke. So uh, I think if that one, I think if I did this one yesterday, 
then this one would have been my hottest pepper till this point. Um, but since I did the other one, um, that one beat this one out and still remains my hottest pepper. It feels like it's getting a little bit easier to talk and a little bit less of a heat. Um, at the very least, not as sharp. Still salivating a lot, sweating a lot. Um, starting to feel pain in my chest. Um, that'll, uh, that'll eventually go down. Um, I'm definitely going to drink some yogurt after this. It's not a, it's not a maybe. I'm going to take precautions tonight, so. Um, yeah. Oh man, it's much better already. Um, still, still hurts a little bit, but, uh, like a lot less of the breathing out is making it worse. Um, like it's still kind of there, but it's not nearly as bad. Um, however, the, uh, the tongue, top of the tongue and maybe a little on the sides feels like it's burning hotter than it was before. Excuse me. Excuse me. I guess it's doing its uh, number on my sinuses as well. Still stinging on the tongue. Um, back of the throat is mostly gone. Um, it's kind of glowing back there a little bit. And then uh, roof of the mouth is starting to sting a little bit. Um, <clears throat> nothing too crazy. Um, I think, I think maybe feels a little more like habanero heat at this point. Um, but was definitely hotter before. Definitely hotter. <laughs> like I'm still sweating. Um. Yeah. Uh, like I said earlier, the flavor's interesting. There was like a hint of uh, sweetness for like a few seconds, and then that kind of disappeared. Um, I can't put a finger on what the flavor was, but almost like some kind of candy. Um, it was a, a pleasant, like, taste. Um, I imagine... If my tolerance goes up um, more than it is right now, then uh, I'll probably be able to pinpoint more of that flavor. But uh, currently, I don't think I'm at that level. <laughs> it was uh, it was nice though. Still nice to breathe in just a little bit. Especially now that when I breathe out, it doesn't come back um, immediately. Uh, swallowing saliva still brings back some of the burn, but uh, not as intensely as before. And at this point, I think we're like below habanero heat. Um, still pretty hot, but uh, like not not feeling like I'm dying anymore. <laughs> um,
Yeah, I mean, these uh, these peppers are no joke. I knew I was in for some hurt, but some of these are pretty gnarly. Makes me nervous for going into hotter pods. Really nervous. <laughs> um, but I imagine I'll get there. I'll get there. All right. Um, I think the burn is actually pretty much gone. Um, maybe just a little bit of sting on the uh, right side of the tongue, but nothing too crazy. Uh, everything else seems to have pretty much gone away. So uh, I think I'm just going to call it a video. Thanks for watching.